Simtex uses a standard called LTI to integrate with Canvas. This offers a way for your students to access Simtex using single sign-on and automatically transfer grades from Simtex to your LMS gradebook. This video will help you set that up. This process is mostly a one-time setup, so follow along with us and we'll take you through the steps to get it running successfully. Firstly, we need to apply the Simtex app within Canvas. If you have admin access, you can set this up by clicking admin on the sidebar, your account name, and then heading down to settings at the bottom. Lastly, hit the apps tab that's across the top. If you do not have admin access, you can still do this at a course level by going into one of your courses and then settings. And then from there, you should be able to see the same apps tab. Both methods should show the same screen as seen here. Now we need to search for Simtex. Click on it when it appears, hit the add app button, and then type in the consumer key and the secret key. I'm just using a demo one for this example, but if you've not received these, please contact support at simtex.com for your specific keys. After submitting these keys, it should successfully install and show the installed message on the Simtex thumbnail. It is now ready to be used within an assignment in your course. With app setup done, it is now time to set up an assignment using what we've just set up and verify that the integration is working. Hit the courses button on the left and go into a new or existing course. Under Assignments, hit the grey plus icon to add an assignment. In the pop-up, select External Tool from the drop-down. For the name, we suggest you use the name of the Simtex module that you're going to be using for this assignment. For this video example, we'll be using the Adult Basic Life Support module. Hit the More Options button and customise your assignment to how you'd like it to be. When ready to proceed, scroll down to the Submission Type section. Under the Submission Type section, Ensure that external tool is selected, and then go ahead and click the Find button. Then the Simtex app we created earlier in the video. After selecting the Simtex app, you'll be presented with a screen where you can select the category of the module you wish to use for this assignment, or you can search directly for the specific module using the search bar. Once you have found your module, the Link button will set that module to run for this assignment. Clicking on the settings will allow you to change a few things about how that module is displayed, from which score is passed back, to what is shown to the user when they access it, and more. You can also modify what parts of a module are displayed to the student. A few examples. For something like a learning assignment, you could display only the learn mode simulation scenario. Alternatively, for a testing assignment, you could display the test mode simulation only, and you could even select the specific test scenario you want the student to complete. Alternatively, you can set it so the multiple choice quiz is the only thing that displays. Note that the integration only allows for one score to be passed back per session. So for example, if you wanted a test mode simulation and a quiz recorded, you will need to set up two assignments per module. Lastly, make sure you check the load this tool in a new tab checkbox, as some errors could occur to some users when loaded within the same window. This can also improve the student's experience as they have more room to access Simtex. That's all. Now we need to save and verify. Scroll down and hit Save and Publish. On the following screen, hit the button to load the Simtex module in a new window. The module should now appear. Hopefully, it's all working correctly. If you encounter an error, go through the video again and check the values entered in each form are correct, especially the keys. Once integration is complete, students and instructors will have access to Simtex through the assignments or links you have set up in your LMS. Students should now use your LMS as their sole method of access to Simtex. For more information, please read the integration guide PDF that should have been sent to you. Thanks for following along. If you have any further questions, let us know at support at